Something else that I haven't discussed previously when we were talking about the heart is the dreaded heart disease or cardiovascular disease. Um, now this is a big problem, um, well globally it's a problem. In the UK um, incidences of coronary heart disease are rising, so it is a big problem. Um, and, and the last um, statistic, this may uh, change by the time you watch this video, the last statistic was that 28% of deaths, male deaths, sorry, uh, come from uh, heart disease, and 17% of deaths come from um, heart disease for women. So um, a lot of people dying from it, uh, but what is it? Well, uh, I'm just gonna draw an artery. Okay, so imagine this is a, a long tube. This is an artery that carries blood around the body. Now, when we are inactive and we have a diet that's perhaps high in sugar, um, high in um, saturated fats, trans fats, then what can happen over time is we can get the fatty deposits and, and minerals depositing on the walls of the artery. So you get this narrowing of the artery. <clears throat> so you can see there, that's, that's much narrower. Now that's obviously gonna to lead to an increase in blood pressure. So that's often where, when people get hypertension, that's where that's coming from, this, this narrowing of the artery. And then what the, the artery can do is it can start to clot as well. So you get blood clots forming on here, so it gets even thicker. You then end up with the actual artery, instead of it being nice and elastic and contracting and dilating, it gets very hard and rigid. Um, so, less contraction, less relaxation, increasing blood pressure even more. Now, over time, um, this can actually become completely blocked. And if we get that in one of our coronary arteries, this is what would lead to a, what we call a, a myocardial infarction. Um, you might have uh, seen it called, M, uh, heard of it called MI, which is uh, almost something like casualty, they'll say he's having an MI. Um, that's a myocardial infarction, which is basically a heart attack. So over time, this will lead to a heart attack. Um, now, you don't always know you've got this. Um, they often refer to heart disease as the silent killer, because you might not know that you've got it until it's too late. And it could be that you only have a little bit of, um, what we refer to this as atheroma. You might only have a little bit of an atheroma, but a piece of the atheroma can break off and just completely block that area, that coronary artery, um, and like I said earlier, lead to that, that myocardial infarction. So the actual furring up of the arteries, uh, we call athero, sclerosis, 